what is inflation going to mean, particularly for the escalation of the cost of claims around P&C? Yeah, it, you see a relatively unusual dynamic for us. I mean, I think when we think of inflation and the risk that it brings to the portfolio, we tend to look more to the longer tail lines of business, so uh, U.S. liability, uh, U.S. workers' comp. But actually, we see the inflationary cost trends show up mainly in the the property businesses, uh, retail, European at this point. And the good news with that is that we can address that relatively short term. That business turns over very quickly and we can reprice. And in fact, if I look at the discussions we had last summer, uh, our German business, for example, which has actually one of the highest uh, loss cost trends that we see currently, has actually planned for the level that they get just now. There, there is a silver lining to the whole thing in that if you look at the commercial pricing trend, which has been a big driver of our growth for the last couple of years, we expected it to continue to moderate into this year. It, it may have plateaued for the time being, given that people are probably a bit nervous uh, about the impact of inflation on commercial claims uh, later this year and next year. And that's positive from a top line perspective and at least for this year, and probably into the middle of next year, still positive for margin. What do you think the window is in terms of your opportunity to continue to lift premium? Because at some point you do begin to see um, uh, people turning away from insurance and that is a worrying trend when people become price averse and then decide not to insure because they, they don't feel they can sustain the, the, the higher premium cost. Are you seeing any resistance in the market at the moment? So we don't see resistance. I mean, we do get feedback from clients. So uh, especially on the commercial side of things, we hear two things about the industry response. Uh, so one is the price trend. And I guess the challenge for many of our commercial clients is that they're dealing with their own challenges on inflation. And they've also been accustomed to a very long period of price reduction in insurance. I mean, probably up until about two, two and a half years ago, we've only seen price down over about the last decade. So it's, it's been a major inflection point for people. The other thing we hear from clients um, across the industry is that capacity is a problem. So um, price might not be something that clients particularly enjoy at the moment, but they're still more concerned about making sure they get enough coverage in place to cover the risks um, that the business runs. And in fact, of course, if you look around at all the things that have happened over the last two years and the things that have happened this year, I mean, these are all pretty powerful reminders of why you buy insurance.